Hi everyone and welcome. Uh, today I am back with a uh, not very big or long video, but I have been uh, um, I I have so much beads, so I wanted to make other things than the bead angel. And for some years back, I. I I think I made some similar to what I'm going to do today and I think I used it for maybe it was my dollhouse or for my shadow boxes I am not sure but I what I'm going to um, show you is how to make or um, perfume bead bottles I think that is so fun and I have so much uh, beads to choose from so so I am going to uh, to show you. I hope you can see. I am not sure if it, my camera is a bit. Maybe it's my mobile phone, but we will see. So what I think I'm going to try to show you is first. This is just a black bead. I am not sure how the light is. Yes, now maybe you see it a little bit better. I think that the black color make it not easy to see. But this is a bead. So, but here you can use, there are so many things you can use. And of course you can use head pins. And you take it through all the beads if you want that. And if the beads are big enough, you can glue them. And... Uh, I'm going to show you something, but first I'm, uh, I use glossy accent, but of course there are other glue to use. So, and here I have this uh, metal bead, and I just put it in top here. It's very small, this, so not always easy to... This is not, maybe it will not be perfect, but you can see uh, something like this. So, now you have a little bottle. Now it has to dry. But of course you could, uh, and if you are using, I have all of these kinds of small beads. I'm not sure if this is called sea beads or... But you see here, I have have um, a bit, they are, if you can see here. So what I do, um, because these are great for the top of the perfume bottle. So what I do is that I use maybe, I take this um, head pin and I cut it and I am taking it through the bead. And for example, like um, if I would glue it down here to this one, I could just take some glue here and then, and now I have this cute little butt uh, bottle. So, because th these small ones are not easy to manage to um, stand for themselves, so if you take this... Uh, Head pin, they will. Now you can see it looks more like a bottle. So here and also there are a lot of things you can do. These are for earrings in the back of the earrings so you don't lose them. And I have another one also. Where did I put it? Because I really ma I made this film yesterday, but something happened, so I had to do it again, and then I had glue a lot of the stuff. So, but I hope you can see. You know, here I also have a. This is just a bead, and if you see here, this is a bead cap, and you can also here you have those kinds of. Uh, these are cap. And you can use like this one, it's a button, and then with the bead. So I'm going to glue this for the earrings on top. And now 
it just has to get glued so now you have another one so and here of course you can use these eyelets for for the top of the of the bottle you could but I'm going to show you something I have done already you could uh, maybe take taking this on top here you know and if you wanted you could take a little bit you know maybe an a little silver bead like I'm going to oh, it be us and small like that on top here and now you have this very cute perfume bottle and here I have a bigger eyelet. Uh, I have this is very big and you could also turn it you could for example oh no I don't have but if you can see here here's a teardrop and I just glued it on and now I can take a little thing on top so it looks more like a perfume bottle so there are and here I also have done so I could could took this head pin with this uh, seed bead on and just put it like that and now you see I have another bottle so these are it just playing with what you have so but I'm have someone that are finished so I will show you I th really think this was so fun and also I have you could also use these on top of the bottles so and here I have some finished we will see here so what I'm, I have been thinking of doing is this is a tray and what I was thinking of doing I'm not sure if I'm going to use this because this is a big one but what I was thinking maybe have a kind of wood tree uh, wood tray box or and then make shelves and then glue the, all these on these shelves but I haven't decided how yet so but here you see this is also another one with with the uh, silver and I think that was so you can make them in different sizes here also I have another one and this is a very small one pink and I like this one this is also pink I am not sure why this hope you see it better now so this is just uh, I like this one and here are also another one more a glass and I think this was so fun and here also it's just uh, some uh, beads and yes not very complicated here is an eyelet and I just glued the bead on and here also this is the button so you can uh, do it and do it and do it and you will uh, manage to get new combinations of bead and you know so so I had very fun with with this I like this one this look very old so so this is so fun to do and also I have been making some um, I have bought some no, I made some bead angel but I have used my smiley face and these got so cute look at this cute face I just love those so and also I have bought and I made this one <laughs> I think they are so funny I get happy when I see these smiley faces and here is another one I'm not finished making them yet I'm not tired of them because they get different 
and here is also a one so and uh, and since I uh, or I have so much bead I can combine it with all kinds of bead so it's not nearly like a shop here are also another one not with not with the face but and here are another one and of course uh, these uh, angels you can make them into earrings you can make them as a um necklace but i have made them i have made one into a bookmark a metal bookmark and that's so cool i have made some books bookmarks earlier on and but uh, i like the metal so so this is what i have been been doing lately and here is also some other one beat angel so so this was my to little how to today and I hope you enjoyed my little video and I hope you have a fabulous day I have been to work today and my kids in school they are making gifts so we have done that and wrapping some gifts today so and it's a bit busy on work but but uh, but i have a good time so so but you i wish you a very good day and hope to see you again soon thanks for watching bye